Hello everyone, welcome back to my channel. Thank you so much for being here. This is Ange, and it's time to do my regular stuffing, count our change, fill our envelopes, and get ready for the week. Um, I know I've been bombarding with you guys with videos. There will be no video tomorrow. I mean, sorry. Let's see. Uh, I'm such a disaster right now. Um, so there will be a video on Wednesday, but there will be no video on Thursday, okay? Um, let's just get started. Let's start with our coin. I do have a lot of coin. Like I said, I'm trying to clean out my office so I can switch jobs, I'm trying to get everything done and everything cleaned out. And I am um, kind of failing, but that's okay. It'll get there. Um, it's just been a busy week. Uh, today I worked, then I left to pick up the boys, and then um, I went to Jake's baseball game, then I went back into work, then I got dinner, it was 8.30, came home, we ate, got some stuff done around the house, and now I'm doing my video, and then tomorrow I have all kinds of stuff from inside my purse, because all my change fell out of my wallet into my purse. Clearly I need to clean up my purse. Okay, so let's see. Um, so it's been a busy day, but I know this is going to be a busy week. Next week will be a new week, starting a new job or a busy week. So it's just what it is. It is what it is. Okay. Ugh, so much dust. Okay. Lots of pennies. Okay, so we have one, two, three, four dollars in quarters, 20 cents in nickels, 10, 20, 30, 40, 50 in dimes, 2, 4, 6, 8, 10, 12, 14, 16. So we have 486. So we're going to definitely color in the $3 because I love getting rid of these big ones. And this will be our last number in $3. Now mind you, the next one's $2.99, so it's really close to $3, but it still feels good to get rid of it. So we have $1.86 left. $1.86 is already colored in. So let's do $1.85 and $1.00. And that will be good. I don't know what color that is. I feel like I lost a green marker and I don't have that color anymore. I don't know if it dropped. It's not this one, right? Yeah, I don't know what happened to that color. I couldn't match it last week either. Okay. Right, I'm just going to do this one. Our greens are going to all be different apparently. All right, so we're going to do 186. And one. 185 and one for 186. Okay, so we got three colored in, including the last $3 amount. And this might fill the pineapple. I might have to get a new container next week. Let's see. Nope, there's still a little bit of room in there. It's just this has a, like a stopper, so you can't go all the way to the top, I don't think. But I think we can still fit some in there. Okay, now let's see how we did in our envelopes. And guys, I don't even have a clue. Like, I don't even know what we did in our envelopes. Oh my gosh, kids, it has 10. Spending is empty. Miscellaneous has 10. Grocery has 10. And eating out has one, two, I just spent some of this tonight getting dinner for us on my way home from work. All right, so 20, 30, 31, 32, 33, 34, 35, 35. And it's proving to be a busy week. So I'm going to put the 20 back in there because I need it. I'm going to put that to the side and... Let's deal with what we have here. So we have some ones. We have a K, an L. I am so sorry if this is jumbled and rust. J, L, B. Okay. So the J goes in here and for Jacob. Saving towards when he graduates high school. Okay. 
And we also have C's and A's in here, but those are a lot harder to come by. And then we have, let's see. Okay, so, okay, so we have a B and a K. I didn't finish these from last week, clearly. Okay, K. And then we have two L's and we're getting closer to finishing some, but we have not finished any. And then for this, we have 10, 20, 30, 35, 40. Okay, so we're gonna get this beautiful binder. My friend Jan made me at Sitchy Saves. If you haven't checked out our channel, please do. And we are in April now. So let's see, let's fill in. So we have three, five. I just love these challenges she picked for me. 14, five, no, 10. <laughs> I'm a good counter. Four, eight, 10. So we finished the April, so that was good. We'll put 10 in. So now it has 30. And then let's see what we can do back here with our angel numbers. And then if it, we can put some more back into April. All right, so we have 10, 20, 30. So let's just do 30. And get another number marked off. Actually, I think, yeah, I think I'm gonna do 30 because I could do the 10 and the 20, but I should save the smaller numbers for when I have less money. Don't you think? All right. And I don't really count this. I just put it in here and let it dry. And then we'll see it at the end of the year. All right, so that's it for that. And now we're gonna do our stuffing. I have, I, I can't remember what I have. 20, 40, 60, 81, 20, 40, 60, 82, 20, 40, 60, 83, 20, 40, 60, 84. 20, 40, 60, 85, 20, 40, 60, 86, 20, 40, 60, 87, 720, 730, 740, 750, 760, 770, 780, 85, 86, 87. 787. Um, all right, so let's start with our brown binder. HOA is getting 20. I think I'm gonna start trying to get each one of these paid for the year, like slowly. Instead of like a month ahead, I'm gonna try to do each, get these paid off for the year, but we'll see. So it has 100, 200, 300, 320, and for the year, I need $600 in this one. They should be pulling 200 any day now, but I haven't had time to check. All right, car insurance is gonna get 100. This one would take a while to finish for the year, but 20, 40, 60, 81. Wouldn't that be cool? Okay, so now it has 2,500 in the high yield, 20, 40, 60, 80, 2,600 total. So we're halfway there. All right, sports is getting 250. 20, 40, 60, 81, 20, 40, 60, 82, and 50. So now sports has 1,000, sports and activities, I should say, 1,000, 11, 12, 13, 1,400, 20, 40, 60, 80, 15, 20, 40, 60, 80, 16, 20, 40, 60, 80, 90, 1,704 dollars in sports, so that's good. I don't know what I would say the year amount for that one is. I would have to figure it out. Subscriptions is getting 20. So that has 100, 200, 20, 40, 60, 83, 320, 340. Also this one, I don't know what I would say. I would really have to do some math if I decided to do that. Tolls is getting 10. My husband is working out of town this month. He won't be home until the end of the month. So I'm gonna guess we'll have some tolls, but I really don't know. 100, 200, 20, 40, 60, 80, 90, 300, 310, 320. 
I would say that one's getting close to being fully funded. Land payment, I have heard nothing on the land payment. So we're just gonna keep moving forward by putting $1 in here because it's fully funded for 2023 and 2024. So there's the 500 for each year. And then we have 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17, 18 towards 2025. They were talking about possibly selling the land. I haven't heard anything else, but I also haven't got the invoice. So I'm just gonna keep going. And if they sell the land, then I can redistribute that money somewhere else. All right, union dues is fully funded. Again, I haven't paid it, but there's $1 going in there. So now it has 100, 150, 160, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8. 168, and the reason I do the dollar, a couple of reasons. One, um, I like to have a head start for next year. And two, I don't forget about the envelope and then forget to budget for next year. It kind of just keeps it fresh in my mind. So it serves two purposes. I, I know most people are like, you put that money somewhere else, but for me, it's just easier to keep it in my mind and to keep it on my sheet and just know it's there. And like I said, it's a head start for next year. All right, uh, car registration is going to get 40. And I don't know if I ever figured this out, but let's see what it has now. So right now it has 100, 200, 300, 400, 500, 600, 650, 670, 690, 710, 730, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, and 8. 738. See, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 850. 738, 838. So we're really at about 890. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 850. So that's about where we're supposed to be, um, even with what we've spent out of there. I'm just trying to see for next year how much I should budget for the whole year. All right, property taxes is going to get 100. I did pay that this week so 4120 is coming out so let's do that first 1000 2000 3000 4000 that makes me sad actually hold on i'm gonna put the hundred in because then i'll have the change i need 20 40 60 80 one and then i need to pull 4120 out for our taxes for this year 1000 2000 3000 4000 4,120 and most of that all of that paid straight out of the high yield so now we have 500 600 700 800 900 1,000 20 40 60 and 80 to go towards next year that's pretty good actually okay and then homeowners is going to be a hundred again 20 40 60 81 Oh, you know what I just realized? I haven't done my envelopes. Okay, that's okay. So homeowners has 1,000, 2,000, 21, 22, 23, 24, 25, 26 in the high yield, 24, 40, 60, 80, 27 total. So over halfway there, because we're trying for 5,000. And we paid that in November, so it'll be due again in November. All right, let's stuff our envelopes before I forget. All right, eat out's getting 50. And then I have that 20 in there. So that's good. That would give us 70 for this week. A crazy week. Jake's going to help me tomorrow by taking his brother to soccer so I can work late. And then Thursday, they're doing a going away party for me at work. So I'll be going to that. So it's good to have extra money in here. And then Friday, I will be working. Um, so I'm just trying to finish up. 10 spending gets 10 and then I need to make change because I need two tens uh, but I did a bill condensing so I don't know if I have change now let's see oh here we go okay so two tens for a 20 is perfect so now I have 1 20 40 60 82 220 um, out of tolls and then spending gets 10 and what didn't I stuff guys
Did I not put them? Oh, I didn't put the money in the um, car registration. That's why it's still matched, huh? That makes more sense. Okay. Yay. I love a full wallet. I say that every time. All right. I didn't put it in the car registration and that's why we couldn't color any. Is that right? Gosh, I hope that's right. I'll rewatch it when we edit, but I think I'm pretty sure that's what happened. So 20 and 40. So now we can color one more of these. Okay. And then one, two, three, four, five, six, six fifty, twenty, forty, sixty, eighty, seven fifty, seven seventy, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, and eight. And that's the only thing that makes sense because nothing else was $40. Um, so I believe that's what happened, but I will check. And then I also did $50 towards vacation because vacation's in the negative and I need to get that paid and start saving some more. So I took it um, for sinking funds. Instead of just doing challenges, I also put 50 in vacation because I really want to get that debt paid back. So I'm gonna put it in here. I'm gonna leave the IOU until we get more paid towards it but I'm putting 50 in, so now we'll owe 600 instead of 650. All right, and then I know I was playing a game on these stuffy nights just to keep it fun, but I'm gonna be honest, I don't know where I put the money last time after I played it. So I played this and this, um, and this, and I don't remember what I used for an envelope or what. I have a big old freebie mess going on over here, so I'm not sure. But we're going to play it again, and then I will find it. So I need my dice. Okay. And then I have some money here pulled out in case I need it. I just have to figure out what I was putting it in. But I can do that, right? All right, so we left off here. This, these are both from One Frugal Introvert. All right, so we got a one. So we're gonna do one dollar. I'm gonna do a different color so I can figure out where the money is when I find it. Okay, and we're gonna do it again. One, so three dollars. One, two, three, six. One, two, three, four, five, six. Back three spaces. One, two, three. So three dollars. One, two, three. One more. Four. One, two, three, four. Oh, big one. ended with five. One, two, three, four, five. Okay. And now we're gonna do this other one. I knew I know we put the money together. Okay, each word is five dollars. One, two, three, four, five, and five is ten. I'll put those up. Let's find two words. And this is these were freebies on one frugal introvert's channel. Go check it out. She has a great channel. Um her name's Jerry. She's awesome. All right. I saw Roth. Is that not a word on here? It's not. I'm still going to circle it though, because I think Roth IRAs are part of budgeting. I'm going to put it down here. So there's five and then I have five more to put in here. So let's see. Um, I see sinking funds. Do you guys see sinking funds? All right, sinking funds. All right, so now we did another word in there and um, the money that we save is going to my car because I'm trying to pay off that car loan as soon as possible, but I'm trying to get 10,000 paid towards it this year, which would be a great amount. So here's what I'm gonna do. I'm gonna take one of these envelopes over here. This chair like is creaky, okay. And I'm gonna put this in it, and then I'm gonna find the other money, and then um, at the end of the month, whatever we have in here, we'll put in the new car envelope and just help it grow that way. And I'm going to, I'm gonna write it on here. That's fine. No, I'm not, it's not gonna show. All right, that way I have it, and when I find it, then we will do that. All right, guys, that was a quick one. I just wanted to get my envelopes stuffed and my rollover done and see how we did. I always love to do that. It makes me feel good. I uh, will see you back here on Friday for 
Freebie Friday Frenzy. I'll see you then. Have a great weekend. Take care. Bye.